Hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. Blah, blah, blah. We gonna start populating our new city together. Right, hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic, the Elementaria map. And welcome back to where we left off last time. I did a little bit of more testing. I did not populate the city yet. It's uh, fully on populated, so we are getting ready. A couple of things I forgot I noticed off screen was the uh, heating wasn't working. I started uh, uh, delivering oil here. They have dedicated uh, truck delivering oil. I started delivering bit bitumen here. It's not really important, but that's for the further industries. And uh, I bought a couple of small buses that we're gonna need very fast, very quickly. Well, relatively qu quickly. But um, yeah, there's many, many things happening underground. We have a water infrastructure here. Uh, that's for the construction area and the uh, heating plant. So that that's covered as well. Anything else? Uh, yeah, no. We need the the we need the city hall. We need to make a city hall office. I'm looking at the amount of people that are without their own flats. It's 176. That's way too low. Uh, I really don't like that. I have no idea what's happening. Why are uh, why is it going down actually? So it was I think 270 just a few months ago. It's going up slowly, uh, but yeah, I still didn't start building, rebuilding the house, the capital city. Uh, financially, we're doing fine. We have the sorry if you hear it in the background. Unfortunately, there's some gardening happening around the neighborhood, and uh, yeah, it's just not ideal. So if you hear anything in the background. Maya culpa, but uh, yeah, I, I muffled it uh, as much as I could. Anyway, so uh, we have the broken vehicle. Yes, we had a truck broken already. Uh, seems to me like Tatras are breaking as often as the Kamas trucks. I have no idea why. I still think I like Tatra a little bit more. Kamas are bigger, stronger, but Tatra, I, I think they're just new ones, and uh, I like them. This is LZ. Uh, the articulated ones with the trailers are absolutely gorgeous. Uh, they, they look amazing. This is probably my favorite trucks now. Are you it? No, that's LZ as well. Nope. I just wanted to show you the, the how they look. Yeah, they look quite nice. Uh, let's go this and then G. So this is how they look. I, I really like how they look and uh, they're absolutely amazing. I love them. Uh, yeah, so we have a couple of those bad boys delivering bitumen and delivering oil. Uh, they're ready to receive population. Unfortunately, this is way too low, this population, 200 people only. So I'm going to have to either get people from elsewhere, which is not ideal. Uh, it's really, really not ideal to get people from elsewhere because they're not going to be as happy and thus productive like uh, people from here. So yeah, uh, it's just going to be, uh, it's just going to be challenging. I'm going to have to limit. I think this can be limited to three professors and staff and uh, anything else here. Five, that's fine. Three. Uh, water needs to be. Ah, I mean, I can limit that, but then I'm going to play with water. We do have 500 cubic meters of uh, capacity in this tank, which is... It's kind of fine. Okay, Leaky has a big bucket of coffee here. It's still warm, uh, even though it's not really early in the... It, it was made early in the morning, but it's... I, I use those French presses, uh, but I have one liter, or what's that, a quarter gallon of coffee. Uh, this is my um, <laughs> daily intake. And the, 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 it's uh, one of those like French press that you can press down, but you don't have to. Um, and it's vacuum sealed, like, you know, on the sides, not on the top, of course. And it keeps the coffee warm surprisingly long, like it takes hours for it to get even like cold all the way. Well, yeah, all the way. So, yeah, that's that's what I'm operating. Probably I'm gonna put all Amazon crap, you know, so, so you can buy Uliki's favorite. Um, no, it's, it's the cheapest one, it's Uliki's favorite. Uh, steel vacuum, French press, whatever, and it's like only 10, 20 euros costs and lasts for like 20 years or something. Like it, it can last for a long time. Anyway, whatever. Okay, so we have we have the uh, very little happened recently. I have confirmation from old Gala 
that this is gonna work that this is gonna work let me go and uh, just adjust this if I go all the way down to pick up pick this one up let's go for 30 percent at least full before we start picking things up because old gala confirmed that these guys are working fast that the container transfer with uh, uh claw machine and rail that these bad boys actually uh the are the fastest way of loading uh, waste i'm just gonna comment on top of what old gala said i'm gonna say a couple of more things if you want to import stuff from the border the biggest problem with your border crossing is uh, with a small border crossing is that the train uh waits uh here loaded and blocking all the other trains from being loaded if your vehicle transfer or like vehicle uh, bays are empty uh, which in our case they are mostly are uh, you can use one or even two uh, trucks keep loading trash delivering it somewhere uh, into these probably claw machines no close to the border crossing and then your trains can come there and uh, um, and and the load the hazardous waste actually I would say even three trucks would go from here and load it until the train arrives and then it can be fastly loaded fast loaded uh, uh, with um, uh, with hazardous waste uh, train uh, I don't know how fast they are I still didn't see them in operation so well that's another let's call it a downside because they're so fast with loading and unloading that I don't even notice it so it should work better so if that is true what all gala said then these are not uh, not needed the uh, big transfer containers connected to your uh, cargo train station. I think I might want to test this as well uh, Just to see if this we supply this with the electricity will it load faster or not uh, Because it appears that this one would will load faster. So they have uh, Metals here to do to deliver so scrap metal uh, We do have we finished our scrap metal area uh, where it can be delivered and fed into the system and then it can process here. Now, Old Gala said something really interesting that uh, kind of... Uh, uh, I, I, I don't want to say I'm not good with numbers, but um, I'm going to blame others and I'm going to blame myself as well. But I'm not good with numbers in this case, the understanding what this means. Consumption at maximum production and uh, maximum treatment per workday. What that does it mean what's a maximum treatment per workday if consumption at maximum production is seven and a half why does it say three tons of hazardous waste per day here um, the uh, chemical consumption that's kind of obvious so uh, this is when they're working at 100 percent they can maximally consume 1.1 tons of chemicals so kind of understand everything that it says here but i don't know what these two what was the difference between these two numbers what's three tons of hazardous waste treatment per day and what's consumption if if you're consuming uh, seven and a half tons of hazardous waste per day how can then the, they can treat three tons because it's seven and a half tons then the processing efficiency it's zero percent whatever that freaking means because current production percentage would probably be the i i don't know i don't, I don't know how this works but old gala said in the comments you only one of these is enough for your whole republic or ish uh, probably he didn't uh, he didn't uh, pay attention that i am a sneaky sob that uh, i'm thinking of doing these kind of stuff you know have uh, multiple border crossings delivering with trucks on the same pile all this hazardous waste so we can actually you know increase consumption of hazardous waste but 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 leaky is disappointed very very much with the quality of the um, with the quality of the hazardous waste that we were importing it's most of it it's it's just biological waste uh, most of it was biological waste i have no idea is it uh, on per map basis who determines this there's no aluminium there's barely any metals oh, no there were some metals there were some metals because we have uh, steel here uh, which we're gonna produce with other means but uh, aluminium production here is absolutely useless because there's no aluminium in imported waste i don't know when this changed I don't know what they did, but I expected this to be here, and it's just not. Okay, so uh, let's start uh, like this. I'm going to wait for a few more moments. Uh, I'm kind of waiting for a higher temperature to be there. I'm kind of okay for... You know what? Let's not, let's not uh, dwell over this. Let's just go for it. 
let's go and uh, populate the city here. I'm pretty sure that it's gonna work out. I seriously tell you now, you can trust me or not, I did not make this work. I tested this with people here. I double checked everything and I'm gonna tell you that we're missing a city hall. We're missing, um, I don't know, some things. Uh, we are missing stuff. Uh, well, kindergartens, obviously. Uh, library is missing, so like there's stuff missing still. I want to go for like I wanted to go for higher uh, city hall, but this is a little bit too much people needed for us to get the proper data. So I will be, I will be probably going for a small office like this, and then upgrading as we go. Yeah, let's go that. Let's go like this, and let me see, where's the main entrance to this? It's here. Okay, main entrance is here, F2. I want to give it a little bit more space. No NASA jokes. I already messed up the road big time in several places, and uh, there's no fixing this. It's just, it just irks me is it irks me yeah let's go with irks me it just pisses me off this like when i ruin my own you see when i ruin my own graphics like this yeah whatever whatever I, I don't know i don't know i need to get deal i need to deal with this on my own probably gonna cry myself to sleep like i usually do but um yeah not happy about this. This kind of fixes it a little bit when you actually attach the footpath office to it but um Oh, I didn't check if it has the range of this. Uh, let's do here. And let's build this one here. I'm pretty sure this is going to be in range uh, to here. So, yeah, this is... Whatever. It doesn't show me. But, yeah, it, it's going to be in range uh, of this uh, waste container. So, yeah, uh, we allowed people to start moving in here. Let's check it straight away. We have meat. We have this. Uh, we do have heating over here, uh, and we should have a truck delivering people to the heating plant. I'm just gonna go. We don't have the... Uh, uh, here we go. Where are you? Oh, they're just arriving to work. Go! Burn, baby, burn! Or drill, baby, drill, or something like that. Uh, and there we go. Uh, we actually started filling the storages pretty late in the year. It's November already. It's heating season. Uh, they will be working like crazy here, 64%. Uh, the distance that they are covering is very close. I think they're going to overla overlap a lot of workers, which is fine. Coffee time. Mm, I can see straight away that um, cheat mode is not on, so let's turn on the cheat mode just to get better statistics. And uh, all of this is going to be done, all of this is going to be done, and uh, we need to start changing. I am not going to get a lot of people here. We can check what people need. They need uh, t -t 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 culture. Yes, that's, um, that's this bad boy here. Let me do this. Let's go for number three. Number three, get workers from here. And then let's assign the library to you. Uh, library to you and uh, we only have 15 extra workers here that's gonna be really challenging to get these bad boys to work efficiently I'm just gonna change all of them to this um, getting these poor people like the poor people people who don't have uh, currently um, uh, homes not homes but uh, places to live in the, and work in our Republic that they're living on their own uh, are not ideal candidates for this for transferring. I would rather import people, but um, yeah, I, I would like to have all the amenities, everything that they need here. As you can see, a couple of them missing jobs. I think the city is going to slowly increase in population. Uh, we'll see. I, I don't really mind how many people are there. We saw how many were without flats, like 200, 250. So somewhere in that ballpark is where we are at. Uh, one important thing is that they're actually working, walking to work now. I will stop this nonsense now. Uh, that would be the... These guys. Go and be parked. Yeah, that's fine. And remove this so so they don't have to come here. Uh, people can work now here. This is going to work way more efficiently now. Gravel processing. 
Uh, it should work constantly. Uh, I will finish the rest of the construction area before I start taking gravel from here. I don't want to redirect them here and then later over here. So gravel is going to be important. Um, we are missing the we're missing the parking space here. Or sorry, the we are missing the bus station uh, for our buses. And this is something I've been thinking now. Uh, we we said we're going to start rail construction, and I I think I asked this before and I totally forgot. But hit the comment section. Uh, does railroad construction office make trams, or is it vehicle construction office? I don't know. I forgot. But uh, I'm planning to go for both. Unfortunately, due to the uh, three division hating this channel and Oliki personally, uh, we got like five earthquakes and I, I'm really now stuck with rebuilding all of this, which is going to take forever. And uh, even worse, so even more so with this, I have a feeling that I mean, not to made a mistake, but that this is really a bad way to approach it to have straight away go to 50% of, uh, oh, 40%. Whenever there's a 40% damage on the buildings to go and repair them, I think I'm gonna go back to 50%. I think that's initial setup. When the building is damaged 50%, go and repair it. Uh, I will change this reconstruction, 50%. As it... Wait a minute, why is everything selected here? I have no idea. Like, how much are you actually damaged? Oh, this is a... Uh, uh, how do I see a house from this view? You are 48%. No, 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 that's quality of apartments. Uh, the 45% were there. Yeah, I need to go to 50% and see from there. This is one of the downsides of making these kind of super blocks and smaller apartments all together. Is this is enormous amounts of buildings and each uh, individual one needs to be repaired. Well, you have these kind of buildings with 150 people work, uh, living in them. Once this is damaged or wear and tear goes to 50%, yeah, it's rebuilt. But this is a housing for like that, that replaces four of these houses so four of these uh, uh, super blocks that uh, we started making here I'll still experiment with this uh, we still need people like people are needed I don't want to say denser is better because I would be making Dnipro flats and stuff uh, like that uh, I I am not I, I'm not there yet. I don't want to do it. It's, it's still uh, this or this. Personally, I like this because I grew up here. I grew up with uh, one uh, commie block surrounded by a lot of trees and benches and basketball courts and you know this kind of stuff. This is not natural for me. This kind of like old townhouses where there's no uh, greenery, there's no playgrounds, only like blocks. This is like. Parts of the city, old Central European cities, Vienna, Prague, uh, even the capital of Zagreb, where I uh, spent a lot of time, uh, the city center with all the buildings, they have this kind of density. Uh, Valencia has that as well. Uh, some of the cities that are built like this, none of them mentioned here because I like all of those, is freaking Dublin. It's literally this, there's no parks in Dublin. There's a dotted park here and there, but like greenery, benches, squares, uh, sports playgrounds, all this stuff is fenced, uh, walled off from everywhere. It's just, you just have a street and nothing else. I don't like that. Uh, just personal rant. So uh, he's he's on a he's on a on a roll here. So what's the deal with this? Why are you not heating all the way? Okay, it's hot all the way, but this is not sustainable because they really need to be on top of the game. I shouldn't be getting notifications that it's that they are not working here. So we need to start with the. Uh, Right, so trams. I wanted to uh, uh, tram up all the cities that we have. I really want to do that. I think that's one of the first things in the future I'm going to do. Uh, I'm going to build trams. Uh, what, whatever factory produces trams, I'm going to potentially just use that for public transport everywhere. I think it's the best. Personal choice, I still think it's the best. Okay, I... Uh, we need to monitor this situation here. We need to assign construction offices to actually do some work. So I'm just going to go one by one. I'm not going to. I'm going to be knocking them out of the ballpark one by one. The reason behind it is, oh, perfect, library is done. Woohoo! Um, yeah, uh, do we have? Looks like we have enough people in town now. Ah, no, you don't. No, you don't. There's not enough workers here, so we really need to increase the population here. I can. 
I, I'll, I'll see. Why. Okay, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll, let me assign these constructions first. So, uh, two and three need workers. So let's go with number two. And then three. Uh, I really need to be on top of this. What, what is you? Okay, this is the fuel distribution. So this is for fuel uh, stations, also imports and distribution of everything. Well, I think I'm going to import from the border crossing because it's closer than our fuel storage. So uh, fuel distro. There we go fuel distribution will notify me when it's done okay let's get some people let's get some souls here traffic jam i don't like this this is bad yeah this is why we need fuel distribution because this happens go away and go away they go for refueling these excavators oh we have two of them so go here and go here they are now refueled, but we need to deliver fuel into these. So this is why we need fuel distribution. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Let's see. We need souls. I'm the Grim Reaper coming to take the uh, people for to, to the factories. Stop crying. You're going to work. Okay, how many? Like a few hundred. Let's go start with 200. That's two, three... Uh, four, let's go with ten of these. Five, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right, the, uh, we are not only missing that, we're missing a police station. If you're gonna put immigra uh, immigration, uh, you know what you need? No, I'm kidding. So, uh, I'm gonna put these people here, they're not gonna be happy. Uh, nobody is, I'm not happy about this. I wish you were loyal and uh, 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 better, but you're not. So, yeah, that's how we treat our people. Unfortunately, it is what it is. And uh, we're gonna start building a police station and secret police as well. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, we're missing that one as well. So, there we go. Spread out a little bit in the other buildings. Heating problem. You do not have a heating problem. That was old news. Fake news. You're fake news. Loyalty seems to be low. Oh, that's not even here. Okay, just remove these messages. That's all fine. Okay, so we have uh, two other things we need to build here. That would be a police station and uh, secret service. So, secret police and the... Well, secret service, secret police. Let's go with something different. This is a police station. How many detectives? Six, that's... Uh, Twelve, that's not enough. We need bigger. We need something in the ballpark of 30. Uh, yeah, okay. This is 30. Uh, all the way here? Maybe. Uh, we can do it... We can do it here. Because the waste containers are going to be here as well. So, if we go like this... Initially, one, two, three, four, five, that's it. There we go, waste containers. Uh, I'm going to continue with the blocks five by five or ten by ten here. This is how I'm going to do in this neighborhood, and uh, this road is going to have to be upgraded. Good place to stop as any. No, we can do it in this direction as well. There we go. That's fine. We can get more containers and blocks here. Actually, I can do this one as well. Wow, that's a lot of... Yeah, this needs to be there. Uh, footpaths and yoink. Let's see if I can squeeze in container stand over here as well. Oh, perfect. Ah, oh, sweet. There we go. Uh, that is it. Yeah. Six by six is start over here in this neighborhood, and I'll, I'll see what I'm gonna do here. Uh, currently, I started five by fives, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. Okay, um, what else do we need to make people happy here? So, new population is here. Uh, constant production of gravel should be there. Fuel is something I'm concerned about. Uh, I will have to focus on this. So, fuel is being made here. So, we are making the fuel distribution office. Uh, these guys are done with everything. Wow, they're fast now. That's great. Okay, uh, fuel distro. That's already being worked on. Go away. What's with this conveyor? Nobody's working on this bus one. Go for it. 
And then garbage containers are not the fine when done. And bus... Who was it? That's bus 2. Yeah, bus 2 goes for it. There you go. This is what we're doing here. I still didn't start on the railroad production and stuff. I'm still balancing my... Um, I'm still uh, kind of focusing my thoughts what I'm gonna... Oh, government loyalty. That needs to be high. Uh, what is it here? 70... 66% I'm gonna go for... S what? I'm gonna go for 70... Only best of the best of the best, sir. Right, so school finally here. Do you have any complaints? Any complaints? Any complaints? Culture? Ooh, culture. Yeah, sure, sure, I can do that. House of Culture. Well, a little bit of capacity. I think we're still going to need more culture than this. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to expand the, the probably six by sixes here. So let me go for the next level of uh, development in this neighborhood. Uh, three, six. I think that's it. Uh, this is five. This is six. So something like this. And then footpath will go. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. This is a little bit... Yeah, stretched. I mean, we can do it, but uh, yeah, I'll probably do it. And then this uh, needs to be removed. And then here we need to build this one. Actually, just just potentially for the sake of it, I might leave it here. No, I, I don't see this needing. Uh, that doesn't matter. I'll remove it, and uh, it's gonna be gone next time I see it. Build this. Uh, that's fine. And. How far in this direction do we want to do it now? One, two, three, four, five, six. So something like this. It's still kind of steep area here, and I'm gonna know that I'm gonna destroy this. Ah, uh, maybe I shouldn't build this. You know what? Maybe I shouldn't. No, no. Let's go for the neighborhood here. Let, let's let's uh, start building. So we're gonna expand in this direction. We already say that we need a bigger house of culture. So for culture, cinema capacity, 150. Do we want to go for cinema? Ooh, good question. This is, cinema is huge. Anything nicer? Amphitheaters, that's for open. Something with more people. What is this house of culture? Big one. Big house of culture. What's the... Uh, yeah, we need footpaths around here as well. Yeah, this is huge. This is ginormous. So if I try to put it here, it's not going to really fit. Uh, I think it doesn't fit here. House of Culture, 50 people. It's a long one. It's definitely going to fit here. Um, yeah, I think it's going to fit like... Is that Leaky being a dumbass again? Yeah, let's do it like this way. Uh, I'll remove this one, and then we have this, uh, this, this. And we need a road here. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it like this until the road is finished, so we're gonna finish the rest of it later. Yeah, they need house of culture, bigger house of culture is coming. Uh, close to the bus station, that's good. Uh, I still didn't start on the tram construction or whatever. We need to increase population significantly here. Unemployed, only 300 people. How are we doing? The unemployment here is absolutely appalling. It's barely any people unemployed here uh, because of the housing issue. I really don't want to start building houses because uh, of this. I'm still remodeling a lot of this stuff and uh, this is really bad. Uh, this is way, way too much construction. I'm pretty sure that this is what they could assign, that there is even more waiting in a queue. So this is a downside of the super blocks, constant rebuilding and remodeling of the whole city. But yeah, uh, that's, that's it. I have nothing to add. I need to focus on finishing constructions, productions, all this stuff. Uh, kindergartens, yeah, that's definitely going to help with the uh, workers, worker availability. So let's go for kindergarten. Kindergarten has another downside that it that needs a footpath built here as soon as possible. This needs to be a priority because people won't be able to enter. Oh, yeah, they won't be able to enter. They won't be able to enter until the... Well, actually... ka -ching. Until the rest of it is done, now they're gonna be in range. 
and it's gonna be even better with the footpad but now everything is in range if uh, when the uh, kindergarten is finished so yeah perfect water is fine it's full perfect 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 no complaints whatsoever coffee time okay anything else i would like to do here no i, I need to monitor uh, happiness of people here I need to monitor kind of the, yeah I didn't build a secret police let's go with the secret police secret popo -po. um. I don't know which ones I usually used this is Equinox Novas the Czech embassy I think from Germany that's a beautiful one. Do I want to do this? Oh, I don't have any waste in the range of this, right? Yeah, I'm gonna have to build in this one as well. Wow. This one has something, but uh, let's do this biological waste. Yeah, I think it's only biological waste. Oh, sorry. Like this. There we go. Biological waste, uh, but it's not in range of these. These are gonna have to have their own containers and then secret police. Uh, this angle is uh, way too steep. Uh, secret police next to the church. Oh, come on, don't tell me that's not perfect. Let's see if we can get this one working. The Czech embassy one from Equinox Nova. No, aligning it to grid or, the, or uh, putting it like that, it, it didn't work. I think this is better. Like this, and can I put containers somewhere to fit all three of these so they will be recycling? Show me all your money. All your hugs. Give me all your money. All your hugs and kisses too. A little bit smoother terrain here, but I don't think I'm going to be building anything here. It's industrial zone there, and it's going to stay like that. There we go. Secret police, eventually. Uh, we're going to need to get the vehicles there. Police, eventually. We're going to need to get vehicles there. So And the snow. Technical services, do we have any? Um, oh, fuel distribution. Did you notify me about this? Okay, let's see. Okay, they notified me about this. What's this? Stop working again. No drinking water. Yeah, that's efficiency issue. Uh, but uh, look, drinking water is on the way. Sewage is on the way. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Well, I'm definitely am sorry because <laughs> they, can, they can start dying in the middle of winter. For now, it's working fine. It's uh, fully heated. Uh, but uh, definitely, as we grow, we're going to need more. Um, okay. Uh, that's... No, you know the find me about this. And then we have construction finished here. Let's get some... Uh, uh, which trucks do I go for? Uh, Tatras? Yeah, I'll just go for Tatras. One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's go with four. Um, this is going to be quite, quite, quite busy. No, no, we're going to go for eight. This is going to be quite, quite... Darn it. I could have gone with less because I have... Um, I have a cistern here delivering bitumen that I want to get rid of. And I have this one delivering fuel that I can get rid of or park in here. But yeah. Anyway, technical services. This is waste technical services. Everything is working. Everything should be working. But yeah, it's all in place. Let's hope that it stays like this. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, press the like button. If you didn't, leave a nasty comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think. Like, subscribe, notification bell, ring it, comment section, hit it. And if you want to support the channel, I have the description of the video. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next. Bye-bye.